Hey everybody, Gatsy here, getting ready to cut some soap loaves. I've got two here, two nice hunkin' loaves of soap that I hot processed a couple days ago and have just been too busy to cut them, so I thought I'd cut a, slice, a few slices with you all. Now, I could have cut the bars after they were solid the next day, but Life got in the way, so let's cut some soap. I'm using a cheese grater, I'm using a cheese grater that I bought at, I think, Bed Bath & Beyond a few years ago, and I have a regular soap cutter that I bought with another soap friend, and it is up north in Northern California, so I am having to cut my soaps one by one, although I like the multi-bar cutter, it's very cool. At any rate, I'm getting these cut so that they can dry out. They are re ready to use right now, but they benefit from a cure of, of drying time. Just means they will la the bars will last longer. Now, handmade soap is different from store-bought soap because this soap has all the natural glycerin that is a byproduct of soap making. That means water is attracted to it, so you definitely don't want to leave it in a puddle of water or a soap dish that's got water. You want to have it in a soap dish that drains pretty thoroughly. Oh, these came out really nice for hot process. It's sometimes kind of hard to hot process, to do a hot process batch and be able to swirl colors like this. So I'm very pleased. The fragrance I used was Moon Glow Soaps, Molly's Products, Molly Supplies, Marlene. Marlene, I'm sorry, I can't remember your company name. Chamomile. It was a chamomile compound, and it was a bunch of samples that she sent me uh, some time back. The colorants, this beautiful blue colorant I'm using is from, or I used in the batch, is from Micahs and More, Stephanie's, Stephanie Graham's Micahs and More. And uh, so there you have it. I'm going to finish cutting and get them in a place where they can dry out, get a nice place where they can dry out, and then get them to people whom I promised them to. So thank you all for watching. Stay safe, stay clean, wash your hands with good soap.